What's up buddies? Welcome to the final fatal episode of FIFA 17. Now because the thumbnail and everything, it's so beautiful, I almost said welcome to fatal 18, but either way, the title obviously shows you guys that for the final fatal episode, or I guess series of FIFA 17, we are going to go with Rude Hullet. Now, I love the way the thumbnail is built. Obviously, that is a precursor picture to show you guys what obviously Rude Hullet's, I guess, medium range card is going to look like for FIFA 18. Of course, we're going to be using his FIFA 17 card. But as you guys know, I'm just very excited for FIFA 18 coming. And I'm very excited for this series because we get to use all of the cards in FIFA. So there are players that we're going to be playing against that are going to use their pro cards. David Myler is going to be using his pro card. Bateson's using Pele. Of course, I'm using Rude Hullet. Nep's using Hazard. Now, I'm not going to spoil everything, what card every single player is going to use that's participating or every single YouTuber that's participating in the series. What I will say is all of their links or all of the YouTubers' links that are participating in Fatal, their links or all their stuff is, all their details are put down in the description down below. God, that was hard for me to say. Anyways, go check all of them out. They're all great YouTubers. We have a couple of new YouTubers on the scene for the final fatal of FIFA 17. Buck Army's a really, really good guy. Good friend of mine, especially on Twitch. Uh, I, I discovered his channel quite a long time ago, and it's amazing to see how in two or three years, how his YouTube channel is growing and how his Twitch streams are growing as well. Now, it's of course his first time in fatal, so make sure you guys give him a warm welcome and all the other YouTubers, as always, show them some love. Now, I don't feel like I really need to go over these rules again this is what the fifth maybe sixth fatal series of fifa 17 so i think by now you guys all know the rules but i will have i guess some of the rules shown in the background for you guys you can pause it and check them out as you want to go but essentially we use a marquee player for me it's going to be legend root hullet we start with a silver team and then as we play games we earn coins by either our fatal player scoring we get more coins or our team scoring goals we get even more coins as well if we concede goals we lose coins of course then at the end of every single episode episode i let you guys vote or at least pick in the comments down below one of two options two pairs of players that you guys want to see added into the team so if we do well and have a hundred thousand coins i might say okay guys do you want me to go with uh, a team of kante and inform marcial let's say or a team of hazard and nemanja matic or something and we do that for the next five episodes and at the end of that then we go into the big youtuber knockout tournament the last two series have been amazing we did so so, so well against such good FIFA players both times getting into the semi-final and both times coming up against Bateson. I did see your guys' very, very, very nice comments on the latest semi-final, leg one on Bateson's channel, or sorry, leg one on my channel, leg two on Bateson's channel, or, or the other way around, I can't even remember, but I did see all of you guys' nice comments saying like, I played really, really well, got a little bit unlucky to lose, you know, and, and, and all of that stuff. So thank you for the support. I think we've improved so much as a FIFA player getting into the semi-final repeatedly. So what I wanted to do for the final Fatal Series of the year is have a little bit more fun with it and when I say having a little bit more fun with it we are going back to our FIFA 14 and FIFA 15 favorite formation I wanted to try false nine again and why not and who not to do it better with than Rude Hullet so this is going to be the team that we're going with and we're going to Rude Hullet's AC Milan roots if you will so well in a certain sense so we're going to have obviously the team be an AC Milan kits so we're going to play in the San Siro the AC Milan badge just so Rude Hullet looks super cool he'll have the number 10 I believe when he was at AC Milan or number 9 well he's going to be in a false 9 position but I think his number was number 10 and we've got all these Serie A players so what I wanted to do is just have fun with it it's the final series the final as I've said 40,000 times the final iteration of Fatal for FIFA 17 so what why not try an old formation that I used to love it's a relatively weak formation in my eyes for FIFA 17 it's not defensively strong even though you have a CDM the CDM tends to push up the field so makes the formation pretty weak and then offensively it takes a lot of work to try and get yourself goals but I just wanted to try something fun I used to absolutely adore this formation so I wanted to bring it back myself and really my old buddy uh, Air Japes absolutely loved this formation so we're gonna use it I wanted to show you guys this team yes this is Adele Terrapt and oh my god have his stats 
his stats. His stats plummeted horrifically, but we will be using him. The only thing I'm going to do in this team from the start of the game is do this. So right at the start of the game, that's going to be our uh, switch around. Just because Farias has an absolutely incredible card. He's got 89 pace, 82 dribbling and all that stuff. And will do a lot better at left wing in my opinion. So we will be doing that. And then Adele Tarap with his 66 pace, 68 shooting, 67 passing and 82 dribbling will hopefully do better at uh, right center mid. We're going with Gakpe at right wing. I think he'll do okay. Three star, three star isn't the greatest. Uh, midfield, I think, is the absolute strongest for me. Obviously, I'm going to butcher his name, but Inform Zemeli. Uh, the Swiss animal has incredible stats and very, very good free kick stats. So happy to use him through the midfield. This guy, Kessie, is an absolute animal as well. Six feet tall, four, st four star, weak foot, uh, medium, medium work rate. So I would have loved to have a CDM with medium high or low high work rates because again, the CDMs do push up the field too much for some reason in this formation. And I think medium, medium, I'm going to get caught out a little bit. But anyways, a good silver card. Hopefully he'll do well there. And of course, as we mentioned already, Faria, our our right back is Lirola, and he looks okay. Nothing special. Uh, Wague, I believe, is now a Leicester player or something like that, or has been a Leicester player for a while. But anyways, he's a decent card and one of the only good silver uh, center backs in this area. Now, there are two informed silver center backs, but I've spent the last, like, four days trying to buy them off the market. They're both extinct. So I had to go with these two guys. Kostic as well. Very, very nice card uh, with good stats. 72 pace is going to be very, very good. And then, of course, Romelu Lukaku's brother is a fantastic left back so we're going with him now I did do a warm-up game uh with this team and I feel very very good I wasn't recording and I did play it in divisions so obviously I would have loved to have this game count because I made the guy rage quit in divisions division three or division two I can't remember and uh scored two goals with Ruud Hullet and a couple of goals with other players I think it was yeah uh Zameli scored and was it it wasn't Faria, so someone else scored, I believe. Either way, we did very, very well, but it doesn't count. So from here, this is where we're going to start. I, I, and I'm going to, even though we're testing things out and trying to have fun with this, I am going to try and practice and get some games in before we do the recording of Fatal each time with whatever team I have so that I can get you guys the best results I can with a relatively weak and fun team. So I think the plan here will be to do something original. Either we do a full Serie A team or we might do like a Serie A and then because Rude Hullet is, of course, a uh, legend, he does link with everyone. So maybe we'll do like a Serie A slash Dutch team or something along those lines. I think that could be pretty fun to do. Either way, if you guys are excited for this episode, my apologies for a long intro. I just, I, I, I love talking about teams and all that stuff and flapping my gums endlessly, as you guys know. But if you are excited for the episode, smash the like button. Let's get into the games and see how we do. Not gonna lie, uh, I have Arsenal kits on right now. But anyways, here's the, here's the first team that we're playing. Not a bad setup. Thank God it's not too God tier. And I gotta say, playing uh, single matches late night, I found a game against a full chem team within a minute. So that's good. Usually it takes me about an hour because I try to record during midday. As a nine, it's just that normally he's a midfield player, but he'll get the ball to Here we go. Him. Good little Maybe pick. Irritatingly him. enough though, this guy is literally time wasting. Oh! Oh my God, dude. Oh, what in the hell am I doing? Yes, very nice. Very nice. There we go. Okay. Oh, baby. What a beautiful play and goal. Nice setup all the way from front to back. Rude Hullet, as it has to be, scores the first goal of this fatal series. So that means we're up to 50,000 coins and hits it first time like that. Stunning, Rude. Let's keep it going. Right back to him. Come on, boys. Another tackle. Here we go. Come on. Kessie's a baller. Oh, no. No, you're kidding me. That's an embarrassment. I first of all missed the low driven shot. Oh, how? 
How does he make the second follow-up save? Why every Fatal series is the same thing over and over for me, man. Silver teams use it, you know, playing against decent gold teams. I just can't, can't do the right thing. There it is, baby. Good play. 45th minute, of course. So 50,000 coins. We're up to 80,000 coins. And is it Adele Tarabit? As Bateson used to call him back in FIFA 14. Is honestly, man, I suck. Should have been a goal. That's beautiful, though. That's beautiful. I, dude, I should have scored about 425 times there, man. Oh my goodness. But what a beautiful bit of tiki taka play there. I was trying to sweat that Darude Hullet, I'm not gonna lie. So 80,000 coins, we're up to 110,000 coins. Let's go. That's a pen. Yes, that's a pen. Beautiful, man. Trying to cut inside and make certain moves. Let's go. 110,000 coins. Obviously, we're taking this with Rude Hullet. Come on. Come on. Let's go. A little bit dirty, but I'll take it. 160,000 coins. Ooh. Oh, that was a bit risky. Wow. Oh, is there is there salt? Is there salt? Is there salt? Oh, there is salt. I can't remember how many goals, own goals. I think it's four own goals, and then it stops counting unless they start playing again. So it's 30,000. So we're up to 190,000 coins. Okay, so let's keep track of that. That is one own goal. This guy just acts like an idiot. There's nothing else I can do really here. 190,000. I mean, I'll take it. What is this guy up to, though? That, I, I honestly just think he's just got his player sent off there. I'm just sending my player in on net. He's playing like an idiot. I think that's a red card, too. Oh, no, it's a yellow card. Okay, I, maybe I wasn't the last man back there. All right, let's try and let's try to see if we can do something here. I don't know how far away this is, but let's... Uh, let's go. Oh, baby! What a free kick by Rude Hullet. So 190,240 thousand coins now boys wow what a starting game for this series what a beautiful free kick as well we got to watch that one again root celebrating with the fans and all of the silver Serie A players look at that oh wow okay of all the saves that butlin god tier saves that butlin has made in this game he lets that one in all right so 240,000 coins already from the first game that's a goal Oh my god, did you see how my center backs just got like unselected? Here we go. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Farias. What is that? 270,000 coins from that. I, again, trying to sweat that to Root Hullet there. Goes all the way past him, and Farias almost misses it, but puts it off the post. Beautiful, and there it is. That's the final whistle done. I was hoping to get myself maybe another goal, but hey, first game, 270,000 up. Rude Hullet has to have a 10.0 rating. There's just, there's no way he doesn't, right? 9.6 rating with three goals, and of course, the rest of the team spreading everything else out, and that own goal that came through. Oh my god. Do you know how I said that uh, I was getting games quickly? That's 100 chem. Oh my god. Does this guy have... Oh, he has some pacey players in there. Oh my god. This is actually a good bronze team, isn't it? Those center backs all have like 80 pace too, don't they? What the... Lovely. No way. on the ball. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Let's go, baby. That should be 2-0, but I'll take it. That is fit no, not 50,000 coins. 270,000 coins from the last game. So we are at 320,000.
And I do that. All that nice little bit of play, and I decide that finesse shot with Rude Hullet into the middle of nowhere. Here we go. Oh, can't. I'm just awful. I'm just awful. Nice little turn there, too. Turning around the play. I went, I tried to go crossbody. I know Rude Hullet has a four star weak foot, too, but just couldn't get it to work. Let's try to go here. In front of the keeper. Oh, big save again, man. No Dong? Is that the goalkeeper's actual name? No, 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 no. Good tackle, Kessie. Another good tackle. Oh, God, I should have just cleared that. No, he's going to score. Oh. Oh, I think he's offside. That was gorgeous, please. Oh my God, that whole build-up play was absolutely stunning. Rude Hullet, what a little bit of work there. I mean, it's a bronze goalkeeper, but still. So that takes us up to 370,000 coins. That should be a pen. That is a pen. That is a pen. Now, it looks like this weird penalty, but we did the cut inside. Sorry, I'm going so silent here. I just, I want to try and get more goals for you guys. I, I smell blood here, and I'm feeling like we can get more. Maybe some huge upgrades. 370,000 coins means we have a hell of a lot of upgrades. But if I can make this 420,000, it's going to be even bigger, dudes. Okay, here we go. <laughs> the audacity of going right down the middle. So Rude Hullet on a hat trick. That takes us to 420,000 coins. I think this is one of the biggest uh, coin totals I've had ever this year uh, for the Fatal Series, man. So let's go. Oh, beautiful. Oh my god, Leadbiter, what a fantastic tackle that was. Holy moly, man. It's actually kind of, no, not been a dead game because it's 3 nothing. but really other than my three goals, I've had maybe one or two other decent opportunities, but this guy's kept me quiet. A hell of a lot more quiet than the gold team we played in the first game. That's for sure. So fair play to this guy. He's actually pretty decent at the game. Um, and I mean, I feel like you would be if you built a team around a Bong Lahore and, and, and then a bunch of pacey bronze players, so... Um, I don't want to concede here. Really want to hold on to the 420,000 blaze it coins. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. Okay. No mistakes. Bit risky there. Do I get one more? Let's see. One more. Come on. 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 One more. Let's see. I shouldn't concede here. Here it is. Well here. Nicely played through ball. Oh! Oh, another! Oh, and the ball bounced right back to me as well. Unbelievable. No disappointment there at all. What an absolutely amazing first episode. So, because of the goals and everything that we did there, we have. 420,000 coins to work with and Rude Hullet from the false nine position gets himself a 10.0 rating. So of course, to end everything off, you guys have two jobs to do in the comments down below. First of all, let me know which super sub you want me to go with, whether you want me to go with that Fut Birthday, Gabby Agbong Lahore, or any of the other gold players that you guys saw in the first team. Whichever one of those dudes or whichever one of the players I see most commented on or voted for, or just, I guess, messaged in the comments down below, I will put into the subs in the team and we can use them next episode after the 45th minute. So that's the first thing I want you guys to do. The second thing, of course, is you guys have to vote for pair one or pair two, what you guys want me to upgrade to next episode. Episode, and I chose some very, very interesting options, and I think some very opposite options. So, pair number one is actually going to be 
team of the season aryan robin now this team of the season aryan robin, aryan robin is pack pulled on my account but he's going for like 360k or something like that now i don't know if i screwed up here because maybe i could have gone with someone better than regular sandro i'm i'm short of his inform card i would have loved to give you guys the option of pair one being team of the season robin and inform sandro but i'm short on his inform by about like 10,000 or 15,000 coins if i could have scored one more goal this episode i could have given you guys an inform nevertheless vote pair one for team of the season robin and regular sandro in the comments down below and then of course pair two is going to be the defensive minded option of team of the season coolie bali and the best version of bonucci who's an incredible card his 90 rated version so do you guys want me to spend a big 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 coin purse on the defense or considering we have a huge amount of coins do you guys want me to go with a big ball and attacker thank you so much for the support as always let me know what your voting is in the comments down below if you did enjoy this episode i think one of our best episodes yet in terms of the success and coins and goals and upgrades and all of that stuff if you did enjoy it smash the like button let's see if we can hit 5,000 likes and then really my only my loyal viewers are even going to see the like requests at the very end so if you're one of those guys that watches the videos all the way until the end smash that like button until we get up to 5,000 likes and we'll catch you guys on the flip side peace